Okay, so this is an extremely quick review of the Samsung USB Go microphone that you can see on top of this laptop. And it's actually recording the audio I'm going to use for this video so that you can get a good idea of how good the audio is. I mean, I really like this microphone. Unfortunately, I bought it for my daughter so that she could do Discord chats and stuff a bit better than an onboard microphone for a normal laptop. And it's really good. It just sounds absolutely fantastic. So, I mean, it didn't cost me very much. You could probably get these from between 20 and 30 quid, or 30 and 40 dollars American, or somewhere between 40 and 60 dollars Australian. But it's really, really good. It connects up to the laptop really easily. It's just a mini USB to standard USB, and the integral case is the, is the clip that's holding it to the top of this PC. But you can also use it as a desk stand. So it's, it's here, and if I reconfigure it, I can actually turn it into more of a desk microphone. It will stand up perfectly well on its own. And uh, if you don't mind the audio, it just packs down into itself. It packs down into its own clip. It's ornamental bodied. There's a little bit of plastic on both clips. And then I'm going to put it back on the computer and I'll have turned down the sound so you don't have to hear all the clicks. But it's absolutely awesome. I'm really pleased with it. If you look at that's it's about the size, the length of my index finger. So it's only like three inches by one inch. It's very small and very portable. Um, it also comes with um, a really neat little case. If that's in focus, that it zips into, so it's really portable. The only downside if you are into making making films and stuff is it's great for recording a separate audio track, but I'm not sure that it would ever plug into a camera, so it's purely laptop based. So if you use your onboard camera microphone as a, um, a uh, a, a what do you call it? A setting track, and then you can sync in the audio afterwards. But I just thought I'd give you a little overview of it. Got it really cheap. Really now don't want to give it to my daughter, but I'm going to have to. And I think I will be getting one of these in future, just to give me an extra good quality audio track with a very little amount of setup. So if you're doing a shoot and you can have a laptop nearby with this microphone plugged in, um, the other thing it does, it's got a minus 10 decibel um, switch. So I'm going to switch that now. Let's switch it to the minus 10. So that this is it on minus 10. Um, it's designed to drop out as much background noise if you're in a noisy environment. And uh, obviously you can see on the screen there the level of recording has gone right down because it's trying to chop out ambient noise. And then you can put it on 360, like a, an, a surround microphone. So it's recording me from in front now, but it'll also be picking up echo from the background. But it does mean that if I go around the back and I talk to it around the back, you should just you should get it just as well as you did around the front. So yeah, this is a very, very short, couple of minutes long introduction to this particular microphone. They're all over eBay. You can buy them really easily all over the world, but it makes for a really good track. And now I'm gonna turn it back to cardioid or front facing and you can hear the difference that it goes back to. So there, that's my tiny little um, YouTube video about the Samsung Go USB before I have to give it to my daughter as a birthday present. This is V signing off, thanks for watching.